Hey guys, old man here. Man, I need more Salehi Bembry stuff. His designs just appeal to me. I'll probably start catching up on his collaborations once the releases dry up a little bit. With that said, let's take a close look at the new Balance 574 yurt in the forest green colorway. New Balance has been killing it overall. I think they have made the right decision in the collaborations they're doing. From Amy Leon Dor, uh, Joe Fresh Goods, Salehi Bembry, and obviously the usual suspects like Jounce and Kit. I don't want to speak for every new sneakerhead, but I got in because of the Air Jordan Retros, which I'm assuming is the case for the majority. I still love the Jordan Retros, mind you, but I think I'm starting to expand the stuff that I'm interested in outside of Nike and the Jordan brand. I first got interested in New Balance with the Joe Fresh Goods uh, collaboration release, and now I'm moving into the Salehi Bembury collabs. The quality on this is just amazing. Uh, not surprising though, as it is a New Balance release after all. The design was reported to be inspired of the Test Run 3.0, 900 V3, and 755. I frankly don't see any of the resemblance. It does look closer to 574 in terms of the cut and paneling. It uses roll bar for the foot stability, which helps on how your feet rolls when walking or running. The tech is meant to help whether you pronate, supinate, or just neutral. It also has New Balance Absorb SBS for cushioning. Since this is meant for the outdoors, I wish they used Vibram soles for the trek grip. The colorway is quite interesting too, to say the least. There are two colorways available at the moment, the shark skin, which is the typical New Balance Grey, and this one, the forest green, which I much prefer. Oh and yeah, it has a whistle on its heel tab, apparently used for getting the attention of your fellow hiker when you're out there. I think this part is polarizing, you either love it or you hate it, and I obviously love it. Overall, I'm starting to find myself getting immersed and browsing for previous releases and collaborations from New Balance. I don't have a lot of New Balance sneakers to compare it against, so I can't give you guys any objective or clear-cut thoughts around it. Subjectively speaking though, I love this, and I will probably aim at completing the set. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, like and comment on this video, and follow me on Instagram.